As we recently saw, Ginger Beardy has been boosting Raze because he started up one of the most unique hardcore Iron Man series we've ever seen. And he is going to be boosting the entire account to complete things insanely quickly. He is going to be making one of the greatest YouTube series on this, which I've linked down below. But this boosting clan gives him the best chance of receiving a purple without putting in any effort. And look what came at 3k. See. Purple on the account, boys! The first purple! And at just under two days playtime, that may be the fastest Tebow to come onto a hardcore account in the history of our game. And this series is going to be super unique and Beard is going to be spending thousands of dollars to make it one of the best we've ever seen. So I will be holding off on a few of the future clips, but he had a few requirements for me to use this and one of them was to be the face of a thumbnail, something I just couldn't do. Yeah, but thumbnail might not be your face, just an RS character. Wow, so you're calling me ugly. Now I'm joking, that's fine, bro. That's fine. That's fine. Deal. Deal. Need it to look good. You know what, bro? Deal's off. The thumbnail needs to be my after I've for a week and have a wipe, bro. That's the new thing. Deal. Stupid rat. Uh, all right, anyway. Uh, guys. <laughs> I've also linked DB Boosting's Discord down below if you want to get some stuff done extremely quickly. And without further ado, the moment we've all been waiting for while doing it in the coolest method possible, looking like Neo from The Matrix. Why would you cover my screen? The last level foe needed to max his account and the perfect troll time to give 50 subs from Dark Mask, who is a regular commenter on these videos. Foe was very happy to max, but a lot of us didn't realize no one has ever done this before. World first. And of course, after getting a world first, Foe had to rush over to Max Island to get the cape. But when he got there, he had a sudden realization. Dad, I'm... I'm beginning to believe that I'm not the world first. But we have some brand new leaked footage. The funniest moment of Foe going for Max was when Bodhi trolled him that there was a shooting star at his location. We can all... Mother... There's no star here. I'm going back to 356. Bodhi. We all remember that classic clip, but now get ready for the base crew's live reaction. Shout out to the legend Saint for posting that one, but another legend who is almost 1,000 dry on the enhanced weapon seat is Defy J. Oh my god, I hate this game. Oh my god, I hate it. 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 <laughs> The man is trapped in the CG prison, and as you can see, it's really starting to get to him. Part of me wants to see him receive it, but another part of me wants to see how long this insanity can continue. The Bounty Hunter Rewards poll results are now in, and every single thing passed except for the minus XP lamps and starting a new high scores. There's a lot of pewers out there with two defense that are very disappointed. The minus XP didn't pass, and people would have been able to create some very cool, very unique accounts, so I'm a little bit disappointed. And a little while after, after Faux Max, someone walked past and just had to say this. Oh, sh and Max smells like nerd around. Shut up, low level community. We usually see skill specs get taken out the game, but we've never seen him get taken out in this fashion. Leave 
ladies and gentlemen, any peepo fingers? Ah! Bro. Oh, I sat on my own sack. The man was in excruciating pain, and let's just say when he sat down on his gaming chair, he ended up sitting on the old tackle box. Greg in a full crystal armor fight against this PKer, but his chat was very suspicious if this guy was using auto hotkeys. Oh, my triple E didn't go off. Oh, damn it. That guy was an HK too? Oh, I don't care, bro. A pretty big death for Greggy Boy, but let me know what you think. Was there some auto hotkey action in there? Tuck Shop is one of the biggest RuneScape 3 streamers, but it looks like he's made a little switch over to old school RuneScape, and he's trying to get his first ever fire cape. I'm gonna f***ing die to the healer! Oh! Yes! Fire cape, boys! Oh, I died! Nah. After one hour and seven minutes, it seems the fire cape is a little harder on old school than it is on RuneScape 3, but unfortunately, because he died right at the end, he didn't get the cape. Now, that's some absolutely unlucky timing, but hopefully skill specs is luckier than that while going in for this 1.6 bill plus deathmatch. Good luck, sir. Dude hits me from so far away with this crap. Dying on my hard cry, man. Complete it. Going out in typical skill specs fashion, going down for bills of GP. Let's switch over to money, trying to do a little bit of Zammy. Am I gonna die? Should I teleport out? Why do I love. I love. <gasps> I want the. Oh! <laughs> I don't know why she was trying to risk it to get that one last minion KC while she was completely out, but it seems she had the same fate as skill specs. But someone else who's looking to live is Radish Boy while he tries to get his second ever Inferno cape because he had to gamble his first. That was stupid. That was stupid, boys. Sorry about your luck. Oh, sorry about your points, boys. We're doing it again, though. I felt really good. But the man was not going to stop there. He was determined and very persistent, so he went straight back in. I feel like this one's already in the bag. Oh, my gosh. I drank the wrong potion. I drank the wrong potion! Unfortunately, he was not having the runs he was looking for, but do not worry because after that, he made it all the way to Zuck. But he was completely out of bruise. Turn the transmog back on. I can't, I can't. I, I exited out. It's not dead yet. Oh, <laughs> Finally! <laughs> oh, thank the Lord Jesus, man. A big congrats to him on getting a cape that he actually gets to keep. But if you cringe slightly easy, you may need to look away because check out this dance Radish Boy tried to do to lure everyone to his Inferno stream. Okay, I put together this uh, for today's stream. It took me a long time. I am getting my inferno cape today you should watch me i'm making coffee you should watch me and it's really fun i think i would rather wash my eyes out with chili and soap than have to watch that again get ready for ari slash on his group iron man about to get scammed of his cash stack no he scammed one million from me. Unfortunately for him, accidentally misclicking to lose one million GP to have free access to this cave whenever he wants for no cost at all. But at 875 GP a pop, he would have to enter over 1,100 times to make that worth his while. And I don't think he's ready to get rid of a mill on his account just yet. But the man was earning a lot of GP while tackling some Hydra and look what drop he received. Saved. 
You get what you deserve. 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 Now, don't ask me at all what that reaction is, but it was still better than this next clip. <laughs> Potato's been grinding out her ultimate Iron Man, but she was a bit disappointed. She hasn't received many good drops for quite a while, but that all changed here. And lost one. What? Guys, that's my first piece of gilded ever on any account. Her first ever gilded piece, and I'm sorry to say that has to be one of the worst. You can hardly even tell it's got a golden tip. Sink still grinding out the solos, this one being a level 530 that took 45 minutes. Have you heard a happier reaction? His first ever solo staff on this game. Someone asked Foe if he's going to let his kid play RuneScape and his response is amazing. Real? Yeah, like she's gonna be chopping maple trees and some weirdo's gonna come going, what are you zooing over there? And I'm gonna have to explain to her that that's not how you speak English, you know? Like, like that's not how to have a normal conversation for, with someone. Like, I, I don't wanna, I don't have that talk, man. No, nah, I keep her away from old school. Go play WoW or something. A fair statement, but RuneScape did teach us a lot of lessons, but something that you guys have taught me is that you drop likes on these videos every single day. Thank you so much for watching.